What is the difference between the lungs of a fetal pig and human? The fetal pig has seven lobes, three on the left, three on the right, one in the middle, human, two on the left, three on the right, superior, inferior, middle. What is another term for the notch in the lungs? Hillas. Where does the bronchial circulation supply O2? The lung tissue except the alveoli. Why does the bronchial circulation not have to supply the alveoli with O2? With the air you breathe in, the alveoli take some of the oxygen before ever allowing it to reach the rest of the body. Where does the pulmonary circulation supply O2? The deoxygenated blood to lungs and oxygenated blood back to the heart. Macrophages in lungs work to do what? Lymphatics. Macrophages keep lungs still. Lymphatics keep lungs dry. Type 2 cells were also known as blank secreting cells. Surfactant. What does surfactant do? With the polarity of water causing cohesion of water molecules, the alveoli have the ability to stick together and then collapse. Surfactant is a compound secreted that coats the alveoli to block the water molecules from sticking to each other. What is dangerous about type 2 cells being one of the last to develop in a fetus? If the baby is born prematurely, there is a higher risk of respiratory issues with a lack of surfactant. The baby might be placed in an incubator with surfactant intermixed within the air in order to coat the baby's lungs until he, she can develop type 2 cells. What shape does the diaphragm have in a relaxed stage? Dome. What structures work to control respiration besides the lungs? Diaphragm and intercostals. What is another term for the condition in which there is fluid in the lungs? Pleural effusion. Which two forces act to pull the lungs away from the thoracic way? Elasticity of the lungs, surface tension. What two things cause the lungs to shrink? Elasticity and alveolar tension. What is the significance of the sticking of the visceral, parietal pleura of the lungs? The brief act of sticking together helps with lung expansion.
What is the term for a collapsed lung? Pneumothorax. What is the difference in intrapulmonary pressure and intrapleural pressure? Why? Intrapulmonary is the pressure within the lungs, 760 millimeters of mercury. Intrapleural is the pressure in the pleural cavity, 756 millimeters of mercury. There is a difference of 4 millimeters of mercury in order to allow the lungs to inflate. Equal pressure wouldn't allow for any movement. What happens if something has punctured your pleural cavity? The pressure everywhere else is 760 millimeters of mercury so if your 756 millimeters of mercury cavity is punctured, air will rush in. With all the pressure wanting to move from high to low. and open, communicating pneumothorax is one. Your pleural cavity has been punctured. What is, causes a spontaneous pneumothorax? No punctures, blisters on the surface of the lungs rupture and little by little, air leaves the lungs and enters the pleural cavity to non-communicative pneumothorax. You use this to help someone with something stuck in their respiratory passages. Heimlich Maneuver what are two instances of airway resistance and what condition specifically involves airway resistance? One, anything that impedes air in and out of the lungs. Two, bronchoconstriction. Asthma is when the smooth muscle are very sensitive to histamine. What are two important bronchodilators? Epinephrine reduces air resistance, cortisone shrinks up tissues. Another word for how well your lungs actually work. Lung compliance. How can we measure lung compliance? Distensibility, can I fill the lungs and will they expand? Surface tension of alveoli. What happens to your lung compliance when the cartilage surrounding your thoracic cage ossifies? Hard to breathe and expand lungs. What is dead space? No exchange going on, just sitting there. Anatomical dead space is simply the air in the blank. Bronchi, conducting respiratory passages. What happens to a certain percent of lung tissue destroyed during your lifetime? What does it become? Alveolar dead space. What is the total dead space a sum of? Alveolar and anatomical dead space. What does total ventilation measure? Total amount of gas flow in out of respiratory tract in one min. What can distinguish between obstructive pulmonary disease and restrictive disorders? 
Spirometry What is the difference between obstructive pulmonary disease and restrictive disorders? 1. Increase in airway resistance 2. Decrease in lung capacity Gas forcibly expelled after taking a deep breath is also called Forced vital capacity Forced expiration aisle volume is the amount of gas expelled blank during a specific time interval. Why is alveolar ventilation more accurate? It takes dead air space into account. Alveolar ventilation rate is a product of what two things? Frequency and frequency is the breaths per minute. What does slow, deep breathing do to your AVR? Why? Increases it more rapidly than shallow breathing because you are able to receive and utilize more air particles with deep breathing than with short quick breathing. A decrease in AVR results in in blank in volume. Increase. What type of response trips yawning? Vesovaginal. What is Dalton's law of partial pressures? Total pressure exerted by a mixture of gases. Each gas will dissolve in liquid proportional to its pressure is also known as blank. Henry's Law Nitrogen insoluble in plasma, CO2 most soluble. Why, how do divers get the vents? Coming up from high water pressure too quickly forms bubbles that block vascular pathways to CVA. Why is the PO2 of venous blood 40 mm of mercury and alveoli PO2 is 104 mm of mercury? It is quicker with a greater concentration gradient. Why does the O2 concentration decrease before it reaches the alveoli? It is being snagged by the tissue before the alveoli. When does CO2 increase O2? CO2, CO2 concentration increases in the veins after capillaries. PO2 decreases. PCO2 increases by 5 mm millimeters of mercury. Not a lot. BCCO2 TRF. You exhale mostly CO2. False, you exhale more O2BC of dead air space. Ventilation is the ability to get air to the blank. Lungs Perfusion is blood supply to the blank and the ability to blank hemoglobin. Lungs oxygenate. Ventilation to perfusion ratio describes. The oxygen molecules don't all make it all the way to the tissues, some get stolen by the alveoli.
What is the result of proper perfusion but a decrease in ventilation? Pulmonary arterioles serving these alveoli constrict. Perfusion affected and an increase in ventilation would result in Facetilation to pick up as much oxygen as it can. No ventilation equals blank. Bypass. No perfusion equals blank. Facetilate. What is the main idea behind ventilation perfusion coupling? Changes in PCO2 in the alveoli causes changes in the diameter of the bronchioles. TRF CO2 actually regulates everything. True. If we need more O2 equals facetilate except in the blank. Lungs An increase in the output of CO2 and too high of a pH result in blank. Respiratory alkalosis What might one get a VQ scan for? To rule out an embolism EVQ shows a pulmonary embolism in the lungs if what is showing. If the lungs aren't lit up. What is super dangerous about water in the lungs? Hard to get O2 in and CO2 out could result in coronary heart failure. What is affinity? Oxygen's ability to bind with hemoglobin. If temp increases, oxygen's affinity blank decreases. If pH decreases, oxygen's affinity blank decreases. What are the four factors that influence affinity? Partial pressure of gases, temp, pH, concentration of BPG. Hemoglobin transports blank and blank. Oxygen and CO2. The hemoglobin is 98% saturated at blank MMHG. 70. What happens when you have too much oxygen? Oxygen poisoning equals the hemoglobin is saturated so O2 starts to go into the plasma to forms O3 to forms. Free radicals. Why is superoxide dangerous? Forms free radicals. Free radicals strip electrons from healthy molecules. How, How much CO2 dissolves in the plasma bound to the hemoglobin is a bicarbonate ion in plasma. HCO3 7 to 10%, 20%, 70%. Since the affinity of carbon monoxide is higher than the affinity of oxygen, what can happen? The carbon monoxide can load onto the hemoglobin equal CO poisoning, you breath in CO and O2 but only the CO is getting to the hemoglobin.
For every bicarbonate that comes out of the cell, a chloride ion goes in, we call this blank. Chloride shift When the CO2 diffuses into the alveoli, it does what two things? Affects pH and trips reaction. What is the Haldane effect? The greater the increase in PCO2, the more room to carry PCO2. What perpetuates the Haldane effect? For effect equals drop in pH weakens O2HB bonding. What is the primary impetus for right depth of breathing? CO2 levels. Where is your respiratory center? Medulla oblongata. What is one of the only molecules that can go through the BBB? CO2 Where can the CO2 from the blood eventually be found once it passes the BBB? CSF there are blank that detect drops in pH and drive respiration. Chemoreceptors Where are the peripheral chemoreceptors? Central Arteries, Brain the underscore 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 is a stretch reflex that prevents overinflation of the lungs by sending an inhibitory signal hurting brewer reflex diaphragm. This is another name for when you stop breathing. Apnea Slow, shallow breathing due to abnormally low CO2 levels. Hypoventilation What is needed before oxygen levels become a stimulus for increased ventilation? Substantial drop in arterial PO2 if you have too much CO2 in the blood, you can develop these two chronic conditions. Chronic bronchitis, emphysema What is the main cause of chronic bronchitis and emphysema? Smoking, chemoreceptors unresponsive to levels of CO2. What is the backup system the body has that is regulated by O2 levels instead of CO2 levels? Hypoxic drive if your arterial pH is too low, you most likely have underscore 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 acidosis, you suffer changes in rate of breathing without underscore 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 metabolic CO2. Acidosis can reflect what three things? CO2 retention, accumulation of lactic acid, excess fatty acids. What causes a coma when someone has diabetes mellitus? Fatty acids in excess drop the pH and cause acidosis which leads to diabetic coma.
During exercise, increased muscle activity causes an increase in breathing rate. If the person working out is relatively fit, what happens to their CO2 and O2 levels? Their levels stay fairly the same with ever so slight fluctuations. Patients with a history of smoking, dysphia, coughing and frequent pulmonary infections might be suffering from underscore 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 COPD. Aside from smoking, emphysema can be caused by what? genetic disorder in which there is an alpha-1 antitrypsin deficiency that can't inhibit the function of the enzyme that breaks down proteins. What is dangerous about a lack of alpha-1 antitrypsin? Enzyme begins to break down protein in lungs such as the lung elastin and septa that are supposed to increase area for gas exchange. Bronchitis is inflammation of the lining of the bronchioles. Smoking is an underscore 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 that trips the inflammatory process and this starts to develop underscore 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 calices that harden the lungs and make it for difficult to breathe and expel infectious mucus from the lungs. Irritant stratified squamous. Smoking numbs the blank that would normally aid in expectoration. Celia Why is TB so dangerous and unannounced? Can have a macrophage ingest it, and then it stays dormant, 12 months of antibiotics to fix it. What are the three types of lung cancer we discussed in class? Squamous cell carcinoma, carcinoma epithelium, small cell carcinoma, peripheral lung area, small cell carcinoma. The cotyledonous rings of the bronchi eventually turn into underscore 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 with further and further branching plates